Good morning, Audacious Church. I hope you are well. Wherever and whenever you are joining me, whether it's morning, afternoon, evening, early lunchtime, I do not know, but I'm super glad to be get to share this morning, or well, this afternoon, um, with you. I'm super excited to share a devotional of a verse that has great meaning um, to me. So grab your Bibles, grab a cup of tea, maybe it's a coffee. Um, and we're going to delve right in to the word. 1 John 1 verse 9, NIV UK. But if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and to cleanse us from all wickedness. Well, I love this verse because it gives us a great insight into forgiveness um, and how we both have to ask and receive forgiveness from God. I don't know about you, but sometimes as a young teenager, back in my day, as a young boy, um, I used to forget to do some stuff. I used to forget to hoover. Maybe it was do the dishes, maybe it was pick up my towel after having a shower, and um, my mum would get a bit annoyed. And what I'd have to do is I have to keep apologising, often daily, um, for the same mistakes that I was making. And I think sometimes um, we can do a similar thing with God, where every day we have to keep apologising for similar things which we are doing, which don't line up with God's will for our lives. But here's the thing, the reason we apologise each time isn't because we're nervous we won't receive forgiveness, but it's because we, as Christians, have to acknowledge the same mistakes which we have done. The reason I apologise to my mum is so that she knows that I understand that it wasn't the right thing to do. Receiving forgiveness, this verse teaches us that it requires action from us, that we have to ask to receive forgiveness. We have to confess our sins. We have to acknowledge the thing we did wrong. But here's the thing. Even when we have the ability to ask and receive God's forgiveness, sometimes we live our lives not like it. Sometimes we live our lives in the, in the past mistakes, in the past things we did. Sometimes I wake up in the morning and all I think about is the, the towel that I left on the floor, the hoovering I didn't do and the shame I feel. Um, but that can be true for some of our lives that we feel like the things we've done in the past um, really affect us in today. But you have the ability to have forgiveness in this moment. So why don't you, when you wake up each morning, just pray this simple prayer. God, I'm sorry for all the things which I've done wrong. Will you forgive me of my sins and create in me a clean heart? Amen. And that is my prayer for you today, um, that you get that, um, this revelation of forgiveness, that it's both an action from you and then you receiving it from God. So I'm just going to pray for you um, and then enjoy the rest of your day. So dear God, we thank you for um, this morning, um, or this evening, or this afternoon. God, we thank you that um, you have a brilliant plan for our lives and a purpose for our lives. God, we just pray right now that will everyone who is tuning in um, receive this revelation of forgiveness, Jesus. Will they understand that it requires an action from us to both confess our sins and then choose to receive your forgiveness. God, we thank you for the ability um, to receive forgiveness, God, that um, you give us that as a gift, Jesus. So God, we thank you for this morning. We pray for an amazing day, um, full of joy, full of happiness, and full of cake. Amen. Have a lovely day.